Hello guys and welcome to Everything Biology. This is a channel where I, which I'm starting now and I'll be discussing topics about biology like for example botany or animal biology. So here in this video I'll be growing cress. Cress is quite easy to grow and I can show you how to grow it in this video. All you'll need is cotton pads or cotton wool or soil as a growth medium, water and cress seeds and then you need to expose them to sunlight because for seeds to germinate they need three factors at least most seeds need sunlight water and a good place to plant themselves like cotton wool however this wouldn't work for all plants because some plants can't grow in like cotton wool and for this video i'll be showing you the tutorial and i'll also be time lapsing the cress growing so you guys can actually see the cress grow and yeah, let's get to the practical. So welcome back guys, and here we are for the practical. As I forgot to mention before, for this you can also um, put it in paper towels. However, once again, this won't work for all plants, just cress and some others. Now here we'll be grow we'll, I'll show you how to grow cress, or Lepidium sativum, which is the scientific name. And here we have our container for where the cress are going to go. And I have my my cup with a pipette to pipette up the water. So here, like this. And obviously I have a window next here. Now this this shadow you're seeing here is actually from a light near, that I've got on because right now there's not much sun. And now let's get started. First you'll need to pad it with cotton wool, whatever you're using, to put it at the bottom as a base layer, sort of. Now, I'll be tearing apart a piece of a cotton pad because this isn't like the most um, possible, like best possible thing, because there's like, you have to put four different cotton pads down, like you can see here. I've got two down so far, but I'm making them a little, a little less thin, thick. So hopefully, it will work just as well. Now I'm trying to get it so that they don't all cover each other up. Now that should work for us, but I'll need to make sure to water each section individually. Or, if I wanted to, I could just tear it in half completely and put that side there, like that, and then put that side there. So yeah, I think that'll probably be the best option to go with right now. And then, first, then I need to... Then I need to, sorry, video lagged for a bit. Then I need to get the, cre the um, not cress, sorry, the actual cotton damp. So as you can see, it's getting damp as it's absorbing the water. This is helpful for the cress because then they can absorb the nutrients better. And now I'm just dampening it. So now, as you guys may know, for cress to germinate, as I said before, it needs three factors. Well, for cress, at least this is. Sunlight, water, and a good place to plant themselves. So usually this will be soil, but now this can be cotton wool for cress. Now later on, there might be another video to do with cress. Now I'm not sure how much later on. Depends on if I feel like making it. But there might be one. So watch out for that. Now I'm going to plant my seeds. So just sprinkle them in, honestly. But I'm going to try not make them too close together. Because as I found out in my last cress growing, if you put them all really close, then it'll they all kind of get mixed up and well actually a bit like they grew into each other. So it's like bumping everywhere. Instead here I want them nice and spread out so you can actually see them. Then let's put them there. And there I think that's enough. Yep, that looks like enough. So now just to show everything. So there, now that we've got it all set up, it's ready for the time lapse. So I'll so I'll see you guys back at the exit of the video.
Hey guys, and thanks for watching my video. This is the first of hopefully many videos on this channel. Now I'm going to try to upload every Saturday or every other Saturday. It depends on how well how long I can manage to make the videos and if I'm doing plants, how long it takes for the plants to grow. But I hope you enjoyed this video and you'll watch the next one. Bye.